The struggle for survival in nature is an incredible spectacle, where predators and prey wage constant battles in search of food and protection. In the midst of this scenario, a peculiar encounter takes place between lions and porcupines, where the dexterity and skill of hunters are confronted with the formidable natural defense of these small mammals. Lions, as agile and powerful predators, face a unique challenge when trying to subdue porcupines, whose sharp spines become an impressive barrier and a lesson for unwary hunters. Lions, majestic felines that reign at the top of the food chain in their savannas, have a well-deserved reputation as agile and ruthless hunters. Their social behavior and highly coordinated hunting strategies give them a formidable advantage in obtaining prey. However, porcupines, although considerably smaller in size, have a defensive quirk that challenges the supremacy of lions. Endowed with a skin covered by sharp spines, porcupines have a very unique protection mechanism. When they feel threatened, these small mammals have the ability to bristle their spines, becoming a walking fortress and imposing a harsh lesson on unsuspecting predators. The simple act of attacking a porcupine can cause lions significant injury, as their quills dig into the attacker's skin, resulting in pain and sometimes infection. This confrontation between lions and porcupines is a stunning manifestation of coevolution between species in nature. While lions have developed highly efficient hunting skills over thousands of years, porcupines have evolved a unique defensive strategy to ensure their survival in an environment fraught with threats. In addition, the experience of a lion facing a porcupine can also have an educational impact within the group's dynamics. Lions learn to be cautious when approaching unfamiliar prey, especially if that prey bears an unfamiliar prickly appearance. Learning from experience, these formidable hunters may take a more careful approach to selecting their prey or, in some cases, give up the idea of attacking a porcupine altogether in favor of safer targets.